Hello guys, this is Brian here with a product review. I found this at the GNC store. I'm trying to look for the two new flavors of the Oya One Bars. One is the Maple Glazed Donut flavor, and the one is Salted Caramel. No, no one has it around where I live. Um, but I did find a place online that I might have to order it from online. They knew, because I don't want to buy a whole box of them. I just want to try one one bar. Uh, but none of the vitamin stores around me, the two around me, and uh, the two GNC stores around me don't don't have them yet. Uh, but I saw this and I said, I'm going to give this a try. It is a GNC brand Total Lean Lean Shake Sneaker Doodle flavor. Also bought the chocolate and vanilla as well to give them a try. But I saw this and thought, hey, this might be interested, to, you know, might be good to try. I never tried Gene C. I haven't tried these before. Um, the nutrition on here is one bottle. Uh, calories is 170. Uh, calories from fat is 50. Total fat is 6. Saturated is 1. Trans fat is 0. Cholesterol is 20. Sodium is 330. Potassium 310. Total carb is three, two sugars, and twenty-five grams of protein. I, I don't know how well my camera will, see, uh, will view this. Um, uh, to uh, well, I'm not able. I don't know if my camera will zoom in this right because the nutrition, the bottle's curved. Let's see, we'll zoom in out there. There we go. And of course, it has all that vitamin stuff. I I asked the vitamin, I mean not the vitamin shop lady, the GNC lady, and asked her what's the return policy if you don't like what you buy in there. She said we would take it back if it's a, even if it's open, they will take it back because there is one protein powder I do want to try, and I contacted the company. They don't offer individual samples. It's called Ghost Protein, G H O S T. Uh, I've seen some YouTube videos, and a lot of people like it, and I want to try that. Um, I think this was two dollars and fifty nine cents. At the bottom, at the GNC, and of course you could buy these in a you know big box. And I didn't know how much they were. I just saw this. They had like a little shelf with individual shakes. I saw the chocolate, uh, vanilla. I got those and banana cream. I didn't know if I like banana cream or not. Um, and strawberry. Uh, I don't know about strawberry. Oh, by the way, if Frenchy Girl in the USA is watching. She did a review on the Rockin' Refuel, was it Rockin' Fuel? A Rockin' Refuel protein shake, because I did the chocolate and it was pretty good. And I got the vanilla, I'm going to do the review, but I can't find the damn strawberry anywhere I live. They carry this just two uh, flavors. I'm going to try 7 Eleven because I punch in the zip code, and my zip code, and it says 7 Eleven carries them too, so maybe I'll go in there this week and see if they have a strawberry flavor because she said it tasted like strawberry quick. Well, that's good. You know, strawberry flavor is a hit or miss. Sometimes it is good, sometimes they have that fake strawberry flavor. So let me go ahead and open this up. The last pretty long time, uh, this is Best Buy March 22nd, 2018, so that gives you a year. Open a little tab here. I did shake it up when I brought it in here. My my GNC stores around here, there's only two around here. Um, they're not very big um, at all. And actually, they're si if you see them inside the malls, that's how big they are in the uh, individual um, shopping strips. They're not very big. Uh, the vitamin shop is bigger, a little bit bigger. Mmm, smells good. It does not have a protein smell yet. And the color is kind of vanilla, uh, whitish, kind of with a little dark uh, hint of brown, maybe like a caramel color. Hmm. 
It has that protein, ready to drink protein taste, sort of. I wonder if the powder version tastes different. Um, as I tried the Oya, the Oya uh, vanilla, you know, those uh, ready to drink. And I like the vanilla, but I didn't like the vanilla that's in the powder form. So, you know, it just depends. Okay, now it has that hint, that ready to drink protein smell that comes in these. I could I could smell that now because I guess I shook it up and the bubbles are gone. Let me give this one more taste. I like it. I would not want to guzzle this down. I mean, I, I, I like I like to sip on this. Um, I, I give it a three out of five. It's not the best. It's not the worst I ever had. It does it does have that protein ready to drink protein aftertaste that you get with these. I wonder if this particular flavor comes in the powder because I seen the little individual packets for the vanilla when I was at the store, and if I go back in there, I'm gonna get the packet and see if the packet, you know, the powder tastes any difference versus this. So I know they do, you know, not the oh yeah one, like the oh yeah um, vanilla. I, I, that's one of the best ready to drink protein shakes. Um, pretty good. It, it, it is a strong vanilla. It's a hint of cinnamon in the background. It's not very heavy. Um, I wish it was. Um, I think it was if the snickerdoodle flavor was more heavier than this, I think I, I would give it a 5 out of 5. But 3 out of 5, uh, it's not the best. It's not the worst. Um, it does have that aftertaste like all the ready-to-drink protein shakes do. Um... Let me give it one more taste. I can, I can see myself drinking a few of these. No, I mean, not every single day. Um, probably, I probably can't get the, the whole thing. I probably can't drink the whole thing. I can do half. Um, it does, like I said, it has that aftertaste, like all the... Um, um, ready to drink protein deep protein shakes do you know have like I said I want to try the powder if it comes in the powder form the vanilla I sure, for sure seen the vanilla at the GMC I'm going to go back there and get that and see if there's a difference I'm assuming there is like any other protein I wish Centrex Nectar would come out with ready to drink see, it, see how they taste uh, oh by the way they came up with two new flavors at the cappuccino line finally uh, the cappuccino latte, uh, they have a caramel mochaccino, something it's called that, caramel flavoring, and vanilla. And um, you can get them online on the website. I emailed the company a couple of weeks ago, and they did say uh, if you do order the sample pack, I think the sample pack is like 13 to 18 bucks. It, it does come with the two flavors. MyBerryAdjectPantry.com only has one flavor so far. Uh, you know, I think it was I think it's the vanilla uh, for two nine nine plus. You pay for shipping, which is seven bucks. Um, Jet.com, you know, uh, Amazon's competitor. There, it, the tubs were on there, but all of a sudden they're not. I don't know what's going on. And uh, if you don't like it, you can return it to them. But Vitamin Shop hasn't got them yet. GNC doesn't carry Centrax. And other places like um, Vitacost doesn't have it, the new flavors yet. Um, so maybe I just have to order the sample pack and try them. 
you never know. I want to try that. I do want to try the new, the, oh yeah, one bar, the new two flavors as well. Um, and I could have sworn the lady said they come in car this comes in caramel, but when I looked it up on GNC website, I didn't see a caramel flavor. Um, but three out of five, give, you know, don't, I mean, I would not recommend, if you haven't had these before, I would not recommend buying the whole box. Just buy the individual shake and see if you like it. For $2.59, you can't go wrong. If you do want to try the OEA, uh Ready to Drink Protein Shakes as well, the Vitamin Shop does sell them individually. Uh, the last time I was there, the price did go up to three fifty nine per flavor. They do have vanilla, strawberry, bananas and cream, cookies and cream. Um, I think that's it. Vanilla, chocolate. Four or five flavors. Um, if you do want to try that as well. I do like the Oya oh yeah, Vanilla as, as the best. Um, I didn't care for the bananas and cream and I certainly didn't care for the strawberry. The strawberry really had a bad fake chemical taste. But like I said, I give this a four out of, I mean, three out of five. It's not the worst, it's not the best, it's somewhere in the middle. And I probably would buy two or three more, you know. And, um, so I do hope you give this a try. I do have the other two flavors in the refrigerator. I give, uh, give them a try. So if you do have any questions, comments, please post them below. And, the, the pry used the vanilla as a base in this particular flavor, so I'm kind of thinking that the vanilla may be kind of taste similar to this. So I might try the chocolate later on tonight. Um, so if you have any questions, comments, please post them below.